أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم How are you with your brothers here? Hope you all are good and well, inshallah. So, Alhamdulillah, dear sisters and brothers, we are into the day 11th of this course, named as Design Like Pro, and Alhamdulillah, we have got uh, towards verging towards completion of this course, right? Only two, only three, four days are remaining to me, right? So, dear sisters and brothers, yes, Alhamdulillah, I'm doing well, Brothers, we are in the day 11th of this course, right? It's, uh, this course means as design like a pro, and alhamdulillah, we already have the two design like a pro, right? So, dear sisters and brothers, let's all continue on to the day 11th of this course, and today we are going to discuss very important, very major topics, very excellent topics, inshallah, which will be the key to every editor, inshallah. So now, before we move ahead into the session, I just want to specify your intention so that uh, every minute, every second that you are spending here will be written as a reward, inshallah ta'ala, with this intention that you're going to make, inshallah ta'ala. Come on, yes, sisters and brothers, specify your intention that you're going to earn your earn the pleasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala through this skill, to use, by using the skill for the deen of Allah and not against the deen of Allah, inshallah ta'ala. So make sure you're going to use this to serve the deen of Allah and not against the deen of Allah. Make sure you're going to utilize this in halal ways. Make sure you're going to use this to create the halal content as well. Okay. Make sure whenever you're into the editing journey, make sure you're editing it uh, by taking in hand whether you are editing the halal content or not. Inshallah. So I just want you all to rectify your intention before you begin with so that Allah rewards us every click. Also, Allah gives better kind of search for affairs, right? Inshallah, Allah, let's all, uh, let's all intend, let's all intend uh, to seek, seek barakah in, in our work by, with the blessed name of Allah, very kind of blessed name of Allah, Bismillah, Rahman, Rahman. So, let's all begin, let's continue on this journey of being more productive with the smart device, Inshallah. Can you all just give me a quick recap on whatever we had this with in day 10 of this code? Yes, yeah, come on. Type in the chat box, inshallah, let's keep the interactive. And I want you all to type in, inshallah. Come on, dear sisters and brothers. What did you all learn in this place? We have done so many good topics in this place, class, right? Inshallah. Yes, we learned something how to create the business, start, how to earn a handsome amount of that, right? Yes, brochures. And also, yes, what more, dear sisters and brothers? What more did we do? Yes, menus as well. We also discussed how to create. How to earn through this, right? By providing services, mashallah. So we have learned how to use the concepts of this. And what more, dear sisters and brothers? We have seen so many angles of presenting our our um, our designs, right? Subhanallah. So alhamdulillah, all of these were covered, and we have also how to earn using our skills of using our skills and stuff. So can find just being a designer, inshallah. So, alhamdulillah, these were some of the business cards that were created. So, it was this, right? So, alhamdulillah, we created this business card with our own, with our own skills, right? And without using a template, created it by, by our own. And then we had a page like this as well. Then we have created concepts as well for design, four business cards for this, all together. And then we have designed concepts like this, right? So that we all remember how we did it. Something like this as well was designed. This is the concept that it is. Again, this is the lesson head that we use. And also, this is things like the brochures. How to, a major thing that was discussed is uh, how to add the grid so that you can align it into the 
three pages or four pages, whatever, and then you just have to the content is nothing but typing. Typing is the main thing. What are textual content is the main thing, and in the broadcast, that's all. And everything is the same. Everything is the photos, that's the heading. This is all provided by this landscape. Okay. We have discussed about this and menus. We had discussed how to create, and I told you that Canvas has excellent menus. You can just execute them. You can take it from the Canvas and just do it, or you can do it by your own. We will be learning that as well. How to create the business suppliers in, in, of every kind of job. So, dear sisters and brothers, going going ahead with the day 11th of this course, today we are going to another angle of editing, another. Uh, important and major, major things of the graphic design, a major concept of people talk about the graphic design, which is called as business. In the business field, yes, brothers, is my voice not clear? Just all types, whether it's not clear. You are not audible to your. I'll fix the microphone. That's and let me know whether I'm okay now. Okay. Yeah. Was there was some okay, Alhamdulillah. Let's go ahead. We are going to we are going to we are going to approach a new concept, new topic named as a uh, business sales flyers or banners or ads. Okay, inshallah. So dear sisters and brothers, whatever you see. In the business angle, for example, for any enterprise, for any uh, for any entrepreneurs, or for any any sales, any supermarkets, any what we say, any hypermarkets, or anywhere, wherever there is the sale, they actually have an advertisement. They actually have the banners. They actually have their own banners printed, advertisements made. They they have their own sales flyers made, sales posters made on the online as well as offline platforms as well. Right, dear sisters and brothers? So, inshallah, we will learn to design the banners, the advertisement, advertisement posters, the flyers for the various purposes for the business sales, inshallah. So, in the business, we have we actually have so many different uh, products, products, uh, products in hand, right? So, inshallah, we are going to even see how we are going to photograph those products so, so that we can put those in very excellent manner on our designs, inshallah. And also, we are going to see how we are going to animate those designs and put it as ads on the various channels, okay, inshallah, various social networks, inshallah. This is a very wide topic, dear sisters and brothers. Inshallah, we'll be taking one or two days for this to complete, okay. So, dear sisters and brothers, I just want you all to concentrate because this is a major topic into the editing, fine? Major topic of graphic designing in which every client, whichever you get, one of the another client which you get would be of the business. He would be who would be in the business field, he would be in the sales field. He or she might be doing some sales, some abaya, abaya sales or bookstores or someone with a perfume sale, someone with uh, various sales. Probably you all know it, right? So, you... You will you will be approached. You will be approached once once your cousins or once your near and dear ones get to know that you are graphic designing. You are a good graphic designer. You will eventually get the clients from your from your locality, from your from your just from your surroundings or from your family and friends, right, dear sisters and brothers. Inshallah, you will start to get. And one important thing: do not hesitate. Please do not hesitate when you are getting the clients at first. Do not. Just start making the work. Start doing. Start accepting changes. Start. Start. Just start by taking the reviews from them. For example, create something and give it for them. Ask for the reviews. Change it. Give some multiple revisions for them. Give, uh, there should be a scope of revising. Okay. Do, you don't have to say that, no, I'll just create this in this way. No. no you, ha you have to make revisions according to the client needs as well. Remember that. Right? So at first, to try to satisfy the clients of after you are you you actually do it for five to six times you will you will gain the confidence that now I can just create the beautiful designs and then you can just kick start your on your journey by your own okay you can just circulate your flyers or the banners of the graphic designing service here and there and then you can just get the uh, excellent clients inshallah come on yes it's brothers do not sit back in this journey of creating because this is a very excellent opportunity you have a pro Pro thing in your hand 
and you just can create wonders inshallah taala so are you all ready to create wonders inshallah today also we are going to embark some of the things we are going to see some of the uh, designs in which you all can create very excellent very very excellent outcomes right so alhamdulillah let's all begin yes sisters and brothers i just want you all to be ready with the two devices one for the live practice and one for listening to this class dear sisters and brothers i just want you all to wave the session as well inshallah i want with practice you can earn perfection only with practice you can earn perfection so dear sisters and brothers do not hesitate practicing things why do not hesitate to practice things because these 14 days are only days in which you will practice then you will just work on it right work on some of the projects separately only in these 14 days you will be able to design different designs right so come on do not sit back you just have to practice whatever you are learning in this class inshallah taala so now we are into the business banners business sales flyers okay so what 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 comes to your mind when you, when you when we discuss this topic named as business sales flyers probably you have seen so many ads running here and there sales ads what do they actually have they have their own product for example there will be product right products for example if it is a, a apple store what do they have they have their own products for example recently i was getting to Uh, some of the uh, some of the dresses from the libas store and they were putting the excellent ad i just felt that this could be easily designed by our students itself okay and shall i'll be showing you some of the ads copies as well so, so that you can just get an idea how easily those ads are designed okay and one more what about uh, other things yes sisters brothers come on let me know what are four of the ideas for the business sales flyers what is the products what more about the business sales So in the business, you might be having appointments, appointments for the clients. For example, for the uh for henna designing or for what might what what more might be here uh, for uh for this one for any artist, any artist or something like that. Appointments might be available. Or for some businesses, come on, mention some businesses. One is the products they will mention. Another is okay, and also there will be multi-product businesses. For example, supermarkets, hypermarkets. Have you seen the buying banners? or the flyers of the hypermarkets supermarkets they put the hundreds of products in hand right so i have 50 to 60 products in one flyer and they'll mention the cost of mrp of each flyer even that is the business sale banner right that is also advertisement that they make probably we have made it for various purposes see here we have festival sale offers i have made it for the various supermarkets as over here so the supermarkets i have i have i've been doing this okay so inshallah you will be able to learn through this these things as well how you are going to get uh, the uh, ads for the various supermarkets or hypermarkets or inshallah if you have some uh, some mobile shops in your uh, in your locality and they are putting some offers or if there are some apparel stores and they are giving some flash sale offers and how you are going to get such ads inshallah we are going to notice okay So dear sisters and brothers, come on. Very first thing that you think of is an aspect ratio that you have to select, right? Okay. So how to select your own as aspect ratio? Okay. First important thing is you must ask your client about it, right? You must ask your client in which aspect ratio do you need. For example, if they say if they are not stuck down to posting it on uh Instagram ads or Instagram Instagram or Facebook ads, if they are not into the ads. Then dear sisters and brothers, you can go ahead with the flyers itself. Okay, if they are not into the ads, you can go ahead with the flyers. Because if they are not into the ads, it will actually they they actually post it on their stories, or they post it on their WhatsApp. Like WhatsApp, uh, they'll send it to the clients one by one. Like bulk messages, they'll send to the clients. And then another thing that they do is they send the flyer itself. Remember, flyer itself, flyer itself on the they'll post it on their social media. Okay. So what we'll do? We'll just take the flyer itself. So create a design. We'll take the flyer, and I'll show you how to resize those designs in various formats. Okay, okay. Again, am I not audible? Can you just let me know? Someone has mentioned that I'm not audible. Can you just mention to me whether I'm audible or not? Okay. Let's just start creating the designs. Yes, Alhamdulillah. Yes, sisters and brothers. Let's just start creating the flyers. I just want you all to mention the flyer here, okay? And any flyer whichever you like, you just can take. In the A4 size is better, okay? So I'll take the very first one of this, uh, this flyer, okay? So Alhamdulillah, very first one, it's done. Okay, we'll begin. Any concepts that we were discussing, we'll just start off. Okay, we will not delay now, Insha Allah. So come on, yes, sisters and 
this very first thing that I'm thinking of doing right now is a hijabi store or the burqa store, abaya store flyer. Okay, what we uh, what we actually uh, uh, what ladies uh, usually are into these days in business in uh, these days into is nothing but the abaya store or abaya businesses, right? Probably you will be getting the clients who are requesting you to create the flyers on this topic. Okay. So we'll just head on to this topic, fine, okay, inshallah. So very first thing that you have to take care of, dear sisters, brothers, is, is backgrounds, right? And also the products. Products will always be same, right? Even if you want to ask the products for them, if, if they give you the multiple product photos, then you can insert it here and there. So how to insert that? Let me just select, a, how, I just want to insert insert the photos of the of their designs or the abayas in my, in my, in my, uh, in my on my flyers, what I'm what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna get some frames, okay, so that I can insert the photos inside the frame. So you can even select something like this, something like square uh, flyers, rectangular frames, or something like triangular frames. I I I prefer selecting these things, so I'll just select this one out, okay? One, I'll select one. How many? How much ever if you want? If you want two, if you want three, okay? You can arrange it in at your own ways, okay? In your own ways. So I just arranged three, three abayas. I'll just put the pics of three abayas. Fine. Uh, you, the product probably your client has not given the product photography, and what is expecting is you put the product photography there. And yes, sisters and brothers, you have excellent abayas on the store on the on the elements tab. Come on, just search here abayas, and you will just get the very excellent abaya here. Come on, we just have very excellent ones. If you go, just go to the photos and see. Uh, from the wardrobe, you can just grab these things because this is these are excellent ones for the advertising, right? You can just select something from here, then you can just go ahead. Okay, we'll just select this one without the face. Okay, then we'll select something like this and insert it here. Okay, this is all up to us. We just started off and we just created something like the uh, uh something like this. And that's that's actually not done. You can even arrange it like this and put it something here or something here. Okay. Uh, because this is too much, so what I'm thinking of doing is I want to, to split this page into two halves and I can just arrange it in something like this. Okay. I'm just thinking of doing it in this way. Or we can do it something like one should be bigger, then other should be a bit smaller than the other, and this should be smaller than that one. You can make it more creative. Right? Then what else can you do is you can just put something like the uh, circles in shape behind this okay let me just go ahead with that as well okay, because i want it to be i want to make sure that it has a round uh what we say encircled outline fine a round outline i want to make sure it has what i'll go i'll just again go with the circle shape you can just go ahead with the circle shapes and you can just put some circle shapes behind this you have to put this behind you can just put it like this i want to make it more bigger than this right so that it looks like a shape that is behind. So what I'll do, I'll just click on the three dot button and send it to back layer it and send it. I'll just reduce its size again. I'll duplicate this again. I'll put it somewhere here and I'll just keep something like this. Okay, it's just uh okay. What I'll do, I'll just click on three dot button and send to back. Come on, do it along with me. It will be a good practice for you all if you try it along with me, inshallah. So come on, so this is done. So I, I think there's some gap in between, but let it be, let it be. Just we'll we'll focus on the things that we are doing here now. Okay. What else now, dear sisters and brothers? What do we need now? We need a beautiful background. We actually wanted it before itself, but what I tried to do was I wanted to add the products and then I wanted to adjust according to my needs. I wanted to. I want to have a beautiful background now. How would you assign a background? Beautiful background, dear sisters and brothers. Any idea? We'll just go ahead with something called as background itself. Okay, you can just have a beautiful background. Like you have something like comic background. You have something like the pattern background. You have something like the texture backgrounds. You can select it from the backgrounds. Or what I'm thinking of doing is I'm thinking of dividing this design into two halves two different colors one color of half half one design half uh half of the design with one color and half of the design with another color so what i just uh feel like doing is i can just ensure this square shape this shape and the shape will just have a rectangular shape i'll insert this what i'm thinking of doing is half of it okay you can place it in your own ways if you 
want to half uh, put half like this, you can do that. Or I, I'm thinking of doing it in this way, just rotating it and making sure like this. Okay, do it in this way as well, right? Okay, make, I'll make sure that it is exactly half of the page. Okay, this is fine. I'll even increase it a bit more, a bit further. Yes, done. Okay, okay. What did I do? It's actually above it, right? So I can just again rearrange it such that it, it goes behind it, right? So what is it called as? We have to just layer it around, right? It's perfectly half it. Okay, come on, three dot button and I'll just layer it up. Layer it, send it to backwards. It's looking good. It's like the design, uh, the upper design has totally imbibed inside the uh, this one, this color that we had chosen, right? So now it looks good. Now it looks good. The coloring we'll do later. This color was already assigned by the canvas. So don't worry about the colors. We will do the colors later. Okay, now we are just showing you with the multicolors or something like this. You just have to oh, bear with me because we will just uh, 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 differentiate the colors later on, inshallah. So now, what more do you have to write? Now it's nothing but writing. Writing is uh, writing comes into picture. You can just uh, type in whatever you wish to. For example, let me just write the text. Add a text box. Okay. It's a uh, Abaya store, right? I'm just thinking of writing Abaya store I can write or I can specifically give the naming. Okay. What uh, What is the main thing whenever you are heading on to the designing? You have to have a beautiful typography, right? Okay. I'll just duplicate this. Abaya store, or I'll just name it as a Haya store, okay? The Haya store, okay? The Haya, and then I'll write store. Now, important what is major here, dear sisters and brothers? Remember, you have to have a beautiful text, right? Text is very important. Textual, fonting, you have to arrange this in different fonts, that is very important. So, let me just go ahead, let me see some narrow fonts that will actually take my design to another level. So let me just head on to some of the na narrow fonts. Let, uh, let's just uh, go ahead, go ahead. Come on, dear sisters and brothers. Do not hesitate in selecting the different fonts for your text because this is this is a key thing that you can all very on. Fine. Just select an agrandir. No, it's not that perfect. And also we have some beautiful ones. Galing, Alice. I just want it to be written in, in the uh, written format. Can I select this? Okay, T, I'll just select some smaller or narrow fonts. And for this one, I just will give, will give a bold format. Okay, this one, hang your body. Yes, it looks good for me. Hang your body for this one. We hang your body for story also. Uh, sorry, for higher store and store. Okay. The higher. Now, higher for higher, I just want to make sure it is too bold enough. So let me see what font can I apply here. Lilita one is something here. The highest. The, the fonts, the font styling is very, very important. Isn't it looking classy now? Yes, it is. The highest. Okay. This is just simple typography that you can make. You can just put in hand so that you can just uh, have your, your uh, design very beautifully done. Now, dear sisters and brothers, you just have to add the content. Content is very important. Content can be provided by the clients or it can be provided by you or whatever, dear sisters and brothers. If you if you are, if you feel like I can uh, uh, I can take in charge of this content and I can I can type uh, uh, better by myself, then you can just ask your client that I'll do it myself. And then if you have any revisions, you can give, give it to me. I I'll just go ahead with uh, okay. You can even have more of it like. Even ask for their uh, for their uh, uh, logos and put in the logos. Or if there is no logo, then you can just add some elements. For example, I'll just add an element to the hijab. I'll, uh, I see if, if there is a hijab thing here. And I'll just add some elements. Okay, this one if I wish to add. It can it can be like a logo, right? Logo, logo for this design. So I'll just add it like this. Okay, it even looks uh, more classic here, right? Okay, alhamdulillah. You can replace this. If you don't like it, replace it with something that you like. Remember that if you want to write keep it something like this, but put the elements in store that actually shows you something about the about the store. Okay, we will change the colors later. Okay. Now what are we going to write? We have to write about the uh about the sales that they are into uh the what we say 
what offers they are giving and what are the products that are there and what what more yes sisters and brothers their information contact information we have to mention all of these are the stuff that your clients have to provide for you, for you right so now what what more i would like to add here is i'll just add the shapes here i'll just add the shape second shape rectangle with the corner shape i'll just add it below see why am i adding this i just want it okay i'll just add it like this what i'll do is i'll shift this a bit upward okay even this one a bit upward so that it looks continuity there should be some continuity in the design right and even this one i'll shift it a bit upward this also okay now it's fine to go with i wish to okay now what i'm thinking of okay now we can just write uh, even if you wish to you can just change it to the same color like this uh, like this one okay and if you want to add something like the shadow for this or something like that you can add now here i'm thinking of adding the contact information right so now even even if i wish to add some bordering for this i can add the bordering okay something some bordering like this okay and corner rounding if you wish to add more color corner rounding you can add and then if you wish to add some different color to this border we can add different color to the border something like the uh, this color darker color something like this it's totally up to you and then yes yeah, sisters and brothers you just have to write again okay i'll just write the something i'll just copy and paste it yes you just have to write the location i'll just write x y z location and all of it like the contact details x y z location and contact information whatsapp number everything uh, from where you can just access you just have to mention it all here and then the product should be mentioned right what different products do you have in store so what will take i'll take the same thing i'll just duplicate this i'll make sure it is smaller or you can just go ahead with the labels yes this okay you can just uh, mention mention do it in this way one two you can duplicate it to duplicate it three something like this you can just create five to six bars and then, then add one after the another add it one after the another if you are finding no space then uh, send it somewhere inside send it somewhat inside remember that make sure you are ha having a uh, much space to write your content right because content is actually important for a business banners right okay so this is very excellently done i can even shift it somewhere here okay done okay done okay now we can just mention some of the products if you wish to and then what more if you want to add something like yes it's like this something like limited offer limited sales this sale is only for this much uh, for these days you can just go ahead with whatever they provide flash sale if they tell you this there is a flash sale which is giving 50% off then you have it all the yes, assets and brothers and the elements you can just grab something that you like from the cr to grab something that you like and put it up here then you can change the colors of this colors of this thing you can change uh, something like this if you want to wish if you wish to add something like this 50% off on all products if you want to mention this add this or if you want to add it as a tag on the uh, images for this agway it is this much i can just mention it here and duplicate it here keep it here duplicate it here keep it here and add it in your own ways right this is how you can just make use of this or there is even the tags you just write tag okay you will just find this okay this will be used in in some of some other products inshallah which we are going to discuss in upcoming sessions okay so even this for this white actually suits well so you can just go ahead with this white the white thing a white one and then you can just add a tagline like this because this is mentioned in this format uh, take make sure you are adding a beautiful uh, tags which are going most well with your designs and flash sale if you want to add this add this up somewhere here if it is a flash sale you just have to ask make sure what what your client is trying to give you okay and also these things yes it is the same you want to change the colors of this uh, this one if you want to put it above it you can put it and you can just change the color a bit more lighter than that see here bit more darker than that or bit more lighter yes you can just add this color to these two and you can just add it uh, in, about this about this frame colors now colors about colors i just wanted to address you have something called ads what is it called color palette that will help you in wonderful ways yes sisters and brothers come on i'll show you how you can just make use of this color palettes this is done okay now we are just done with this design okay we are actually done alhamdulillah we we can you can just insert whatever you like in this now i'll just duplicate this up i'll show you see i just duplicated why did i duplicate because this was a color that was already assigned by canva and i didn't assign any colors here i just assigned p and store colors 
Now I want Canva to assign based on the color wheel. What is Canva using? It is using the color wheel. I'm just making sure you have a beautiful style. Let's just go ahead with the styles and see how beautifully Canva will take the colors. Okay. See, take in charge of the colors. Very first thing, color palettes, you just have to go ahead with color palettes. Come on, yes, it's just brothers. Try it all out with me. Just look here how beautiful it has converted it, right? Come on. See here, dear sisters and brothers, you have created a masterpiece, right? You just did it with your own hands. Created this designer all by your own, right? So isn't it looking very classy? Come on, type in yes, no. Yes, no. Did you all do it all together? Together with me? Hopefully, you all did it along with me, inshallah. Dara. Yes, alhamdulillah. This is very classy. Now, we can change this according to your own wish. I'll duplicate this again. I can I can finalize five to six colors, five to six designs and send it to my clients, okay? What is not good, you just remove it. For example, these borderings are not, not looking good for me. Bordering color. You want to change, change it to white. Change it to white. Change it to white. It's totally your wish. You can just change it in your own ways. I already told you, okay? Then coloring, coloring again. This color is same. This color, this color was looking very excellent. I'll just go ahead with this pinkish color. This is also looking very excellent. You can go ahead with whatever color you like the most. See here, you just like this one. So it's well with the design. So if you want to match this with this abaya that is here, you can just go ahead with something like orangish colors. Yes, something like this. It's matching with this abaya that is on the picture, right? So it looks very excellent, very classy. I just want you to see how we develop these designs without any help of any templates, without any anything as such, right? So we just have to write the textual content. Now you can write the textual content in your own ways. For example, for here, if you want to write what you have in store, the kumars are available, uh, the niqabs are available, or the uh, what you are the hijabi, or the hijab caps are available, or something like that, right? So come on, yes, sisters and brothers, you can just type in whatever you want. And then uh, this is like your client wish, okay? It's your client wish, whatever your client has in store. You just have to do that, right? You just have to write that in your design, that's all. So I'll just show it at this format. And this is that done. Design is done. You just have to send it to your clients. How would you send it? Share it in the format of the down uh, download it and send it in the format of the JPG image first, remember? And then if they ask you that this JPG is not coming as a uh, like best on the whatsapp then please send it as a document on the on the whatsapp probably you all know how to send it as a document right and then you just can say uh, if, if even then they find any difficulty then share it in the form of the pdf and then they'll ask you dear sisters and brothers can you provide for me the uh, uh, uh animated version of this design i want to put it as a video on the reels instagram reels then how should we go ahead yes brothers come on what should we do? You just have to click on this design, okay? Animate it and just click on whatever simple animation, okay? Or sleek animation, whatever goes well with this design, click on that, okay? There should be a, a voiceover behind or there should be any any song behind, played behind. And then you just have to add the timings. Usually the reels go ahead go well when it is 15 seconds, right? Go ahead with the 15 seconds and then uh, make sure you're adding both on enter and both on exit animation both on enter and both on exit okay and then just play it up and see how beautiful it looks okay we are just go ahead with the playing this one it's not this one third design then you just can export it in your own ways okay not this one the very last design is the animated so isn't it very easy dear sisters and brothers did you all like it probably yes right alhamdulillah now we'll just go ahead with another design okay I, i'm thinking of doing at least five to six designs on the session come on dear sisters and brothers i just want you all to cooperate i just want you all to be more attentive more um uh, more uh active inshallah come on so the very next design that i'm trying to do now is uh okay travel design can we just do any travel design together okay for example, if your client has a Umrah package, okay, Umrah package, that's better. Umrah package, and they are thinking of uh, designing a flyer. Okay, it's just the, my ideas that I'm giving. You can just go ahead with something else. For example, if they wanted with the what we say uh, with the travel to the Maldives, travel to something like a vacation or something like that, even that you can. Do. For example, just come came to my mind Umrah package. We'll just go ahead with something like that. Okay, 
Now what I'm thinking of doing is the same thing. Okay, I just want to do it in the same way. I'll do two to three designs in the same way and I'll address the same uh, issue, okay? Now, dear sisters and brothers, the same design, okay? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do it in the same way. I'll see if we can just give some manipulation so that this design looks more classy, okay? So now, I'll add one a photo here. I mean, Umbra package, I just want to add some of the things that are covered, or places that are covered, right? So, Makkah, Medina, and we can also add some other place like Jeddah, or something like that okay what we'll do we'll add it here we'll add it here okay we can cover something like five or something like that we'll, we just don't know what is what to put here we'll just uh, put it according to uh, the needs whatever comes to our mind we can just try to do that. i'm thinking of doing it in this manner i can do it like this also one here one here one here it's totally up to you how you want to arrange. Okay, this one looks good, more good, more better. Okay. 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 First, whatever I feel is I I I, I feel like adding the product for the uh, for the for the timing product. What is the product now? It is Umbra package. So I just put Umbra itself and then see what are the designs that are here. So what are the photos that are here? First, we'll go ahead with the photos. Okay, first thing that we have is Makkah. We'll add Makkah image here. Add the images. Remember, you must have a frame, right? Remember, you must have a frame. So we'll just go ahead with the frame first. Click on the frame. Circular frame need. I'll just add this frame. Okay, probably I wanted it more bigger than this, right? Yes. Okay, one frame. Two frame duplication is very important. It's very easy and very excellent to do. Three frames. I'll put Makkah here. Then, what was the last thing that we wrote? Umrah, right? Then, what else? Photos. So the photos we have different photos. Then we have something look like this. The Medina photo. But we have something else. Let's see, come on. It's to free. If if you want to do it, so you can just stop it. Okay, this one. Probably this Arafa photo, right? Okay, Mount at the Arafa. Okay. So dear sisters and brothers, what what more can I do for with this photo is I can make sure that okay, I'll just do okay. I just want to do something like I'll just arrange this both together, fine. Okay? I'll group this both together. Or I, what I'll what I'm thinking of doing is make sure if it's, it's a bit bigger. Okay, and even I can make this a bit bigger. Or I can, what I can do is, I can even put it one above another as well. Make sure you are not making it too clumsy to look. Okay, you have to feel like it's, it's going so well with the design. Okay. Yet. Okay, it's fine, probably. Okay. Now, yes, sisters and brothers, what I'm thinking of doing is I want to add some of the shadows to this so that it looks like it's lively or it looks like a 3D thing. So what I can give is I can give a drop shadow, circular drop shadow. Okay, I'll see if we have some good drop shadows. Let's see if we have some circular drop shadows. Yes, this shadow, yes, sisters and brothers. See how it looks? Doesn't it look very classy? Yes. Or we can do what I'm thinking of doing is I'll add it behind this. Okay, behind this. Yeah. What am I doing? Trying to add it behind this, or yes, like this, something like. Okay, done. If I want, I can increase it in size further. If I do not want, I can just stop like this. Duplicate it up. So it's looking like something we are we are keeping this as a photos on the screen, right? Yes, it is. Let's add this again here. It. I just gave a 3D look to this photos that we have added. So it look it's actually looking classy, right? Now if you want to group this three and put it somewhere here and there, I can do that as well. So I can just group this, select multiple, and just group it each and everything that is here. What I'll do, I'll just send this backward. Yes, you can even send that backward so that it doesn't propose this it needs a bit more down the edge. 
backwards then to do back and then to do back now it's like very classic okay now i just want to make sure that i'm selecting all of these three and grouping it up select multiple one two three is selected see how beautifully i selected all of the three and i just grouped it up okay why am i grouping this so that i can it's easily transportable i can put it here i can put it there that that's what is my intention behind it. okay i'll just pick a three dot button select multiple again one two three three selected very easily done grouping it up so if I, if i want to make this bigger i can do this i'll just add this marina this side and match on the center frame i'll make it bigger it's totally my choice you can do it at the start as well if you wish to i'll add this here and now i then group these three things right so i'll just select multiple one two three selected and done and i'll just group it up now this one here do it on this so alhamdulillah we are just done with one thing that we just assigned how to put the product photography on the uh, on the frame right this is how you just put the photo product photography on the frame in different ways i did the same thing the same thing i just did it more beautifully that's all did you all like it come on do it all along let me see how you are going to do this inshallah so if you want to even increase it in size you can increase it you can further increase this further increase this okay what more dear sisters and brothers over here i kept it in this way over here i i divided it into pages and what i'm thinking of doing is i'm thinking of adding another photo here of the umbra package or umbra because usually it's a uh, thing with the umbra uh, is filled with the pages of the uh hermit right so we'll just uh, see the photos any photos beautiful photos you can select this one itself we will just add it behind okay i'll send it to back send it to back you can do it in this way as well okay or else i can if i want if i wish to i'll just make it make sure it's a bit upward okay i can replace this photo if i do not like this i'll replace this with something called as a replace button okay or if you do not like it you can just delete it up and change it to something that you like okay so i'll just delete this thing it's this should be better just need it in the landscape more landscape Hold on. No, more class. This one. Okay, this is better. Send it to back. Okay. So see how beautifully we just generated. And the colors. Don't worry about the colors. We have not designed the color. This was already designed by the Canva. We have to change it according to our wish, right? We'll change it later. Then we just have to add the packages. That's all. See, now it's all the textual work that we have. Okay, the, the umbra packages for this much, these many rupees, these many things you can just add. I just added a shape here. If you want, you can just write all of it in one shape. For example, I'll just keep it like this, and let's uh, add it a white color because for this background the white is good. So I'll just send it to the back. Send it to the back. Then we just have to write the package names, whatever package you are going to adopt. Travel packages. What packages you want for? How many nights? How many uh, nights stay? What is the cost of the package? I already told you. you can uh, make sure you are adding it using the tags. Okay, remember tags you have to use to add the uh, cost. So uh, the cost of the package. For example, I'll make sure make use of this. And what important? What is important? Yes, sisters and brothers. Colors are important. You should align it perfectly with the backgrounds. And you will mention here uh, rupee or uh, dollars uh, rupee. Eighty thousand or ninety thousand uh, for fifteen days or seven days stay, eight days stay. You can just write it as you wish and make sure the colors are properly aligned. Okay, and also write the services if you wish to. You have to write the services. I just, I just deleted that. You can make sure you add it very perfectly. If you I want to add it in this format, you can add it. Or if you want to add it, come on, you have so many various ways of doing this, right? Okay, and services. Okay, you can just further reduce this. Can write about the package, which package you're having, where is the stay, and also so many things you have to write. Right? That's all. Uh, that's all textual content that will be given by your client. So you don't have to worry about that, right? So then you can just write about the service that are provided over there, uh, or the uh, they'll mention to it, right? Uh, where are you going to stay? Which hotels you are going to stay? Three star hotel or five star hotel? If you have different packages, 
three to four packages if you have then you should arrange it three to four like this one two three bars one bar with the uh what we say with the silver packet some some have something like this silver packet golden packet diamond packet or something like that you can do it in your own ways yes this according to the need of the client okay? hopefully you are finding this all interesting right because you are getting to learn so many various concepts here right so alhamdulillah our services you can just mention and then you can just mention whatever abcd the services that they are going to provide accommodation lunch breakfast photographer if it is there if uh, the hotel rooms are affordable or not it is whether hotel rooms are included in the package or not something like that and then who is who is going to provide the service okay that itself we have not written right what is the omta package name that is very important that should be written at the start who is offering this okay what is the name of this okay tours and travels who is that omta tours and travels uh, what should i write any idea any, any give me an idea inshallah Oh, what am I thinking of now is how do we group? We just there's a question here. How do we group? It's nothing but you just have to select multiple items and then group it up. That's all. Okay. Now I just have to use this. I will just write. I'll write United Tours and Travels. Okay, United Tours and Travels. Travels. Do not write all in one. Yes, it's just brothers. Make sure you're writing this with. Different text. Remember, different text is important, and also different typography. Fonts is important. Okay, font, colors, everything should matter here. Whenever you're going to use it for the cut it out, and I'll just write United here. United Tours and Travels. It just came to my mind. So I just wrote right. Make sure the lining well with the colors. Colors is important. Mandatory. So I'll just. See if it is white colored because it should go well with the background. Right? Now you can even emboss it up. How to emboss this? Probably yesterday you have told, uh, yesterday you have learned this up, right? You just have to edit the effects out of it and give it a look of the shadow look if you wish to. In the shadows, you can change the colors to white shadow, black shadow, so that it gives a poor beaver or embossed look, a beaver look, okay? So, United Tools and Travels, if I wish to add, I'll just uh, make sure this is in the Capitals, only capital. So U N I T E D. United. Tours and travels. I just have to write. I'll just duplicate the same thing. Now for the tours and travels, I'm thinking of writing it in the uh, handwriting kind of format. See here, I'll how I'm choosing this handwriting. See, dear sisters and brothers, this comes, this comes to you. I mean, these things will get to you when you just practice it. Okay. Oh, you'll just get hundreds of ideas when you start practicing the skill. Okay. Start practicing. Please do not hesitate in practicing. So you just don't have to stop practicing, right? Tours and travels. This looks very excellent, very classy. Even this, if you want to change, you just can write it the center united. Tours and travels, and I'll just write something here. You will just even reduce this further. Tours and travels, if you wish to change the color, you can change the color. A bit more darker like this, or something like this. Something like this. So this looks very classy and now you just have to add the contact information okay. there is something in the elements dear sisters and brothers that is called as geo okay geo just write geo uh, you can even write geo labels not about geometric shapes right geo labels you can go ahead with something like geo labels or you can just mention geo there you will get uh, some of the ideas for the banners there okay geo shapes geo shape i'll just write geo shape so the geometry shape. I usually use this uh, keywords known as geo shape. Okay? So come on, see here. I, I actually make use of something like this because this is something that is uh, called as the any any curve. I mean, are you, it's like it, it feels like you're drawing it on the board. So this is nothing but geo shape. Right? So I want to make sure that uh, okay. For example, I'm showing you what I'm thinking of this. Okay. Thinking of using it in the Bottom. So I'll select something that goes well with the bottom of the page. Okay. Your shape, geometric shape that goes well with the bottom of the page. One select something that goes well. Even this are called as blobs. Okay. B L O B S. Okay. Um, and we actually created. We I actually created a. Okay. I'll just take this one itself. Actually created a entire a design with the blobs itself. It actually looked very very classy. 
So even you can go ahead with this one if you wish to select this and you can just send it backwards. No, no, this is not looking that good. You can select whichever you like. Or you can just, if these blobs are not good for you to go, go ahead, then you can just go ahead with curved shapes. Curved shapes. Curved shapes. Not going to curve here. Curve. You have so many things like geometry, curved shape, something like that. Okay, I'll take the very first one or see if you have some more curved shapes. That goes well with this. Bond, you have to just rather select something that is excellent over here. Fine. Okay, I'll select this one, curved shape. I'll add it somewhere here. Now, what you have to add here? This is for this. You just have to add what? Yes, can you all tell me? What are you going to add? Contact information, right? If it's white, I, I, I selected it based on this. And one more thing, yes, it's just this, this here, okay, this thing here. Okay, behind this, there's a space, right? I did not fill that space with properly. Here, there is something like this that is remaining here. Over here. Here, there's something that is outside. I want to make sure that it doesn't look that clumsy. I mean, now uh, it doesn't look like there is a photo gap over there or something like that. So, I can, what, what I can do, you know, I can even add these shapes like this here. These shapes. These ones. These things. Okay. Well, how we can add this? I can add it in this way. Here. Okay. And I can add it, send it to backwards, but make sure that uh, this should be aligned perfectly with the coloring. So I'll just select white one here. For another, also, I'll select white one only. Send it to backwards. Send it to back. Not send to back, send just backwards because I want it to bring it forward. I want it above this. See, and now it's looking good. With the this one. Okay, I'll select it. I'll duplicate that. I'll place it here. You can just rotate it first. This way and send it to back, send it backwards, send it backwards. Okay, something like this. It feels like there is some uh, some continuity there, and uh, the white thing that we have just inserted. If I if I wish to add it like this, the white thing that I've inserted here, it, it might it feels like see it's it's here also. The white is here also. It might give you some continuity. That's all. Okay. Now this is just about this. Our services, the phone, phone numbers, everything should be written here, right? Hope you all know. Want to add some other jobs like this again? Uh, book now, book this ticket now, book your ticket now, and then you want to add the contact information with the cell phone. A phone, I'll just add phone here. Phone, take this phone call, put it here, put it here. Okay, the textual content is totally your client based. Okay, it's client based, so you just add the textual content. Uh, you can add this one, and then there is the website information if it's there. Book now if you want to write book now here. You can just write book the ticket now. Book your or this one now. You can just uh your travel now or something like that. And that is okay. Well, it's United Tours. Okay. Now, dear sisters and brothers, what I'm thinking of is to okay. We are going to create more such stuff. And one, one important thing, the colors I'm thinking of doing with the colors, going ahead with the colors, because colors are not not at all good here. Why, I, why is it not good? Because it's not assigned by us. The color was already assigned by Canva. So how to change the colors? Go to the colors. Go to the color palettes. Now you just have a very beautiful, excellent way of editing the colors, right? See here. I like something that goes well with your backgrounds as well as the design. Okay? See how beautifully you are selecting things, right? One, yes, sisters and brothers, you can just go ahead with this, this one, or that one, whatever, whichever. Or, for example, if you want to make sure that you are going well with the background colors of the uh, of the photos that are over there, then you can even do that. You know, there is something called as the hand picker. Okay, I'll show you how you are going to hand pick your colors. I'll just show you in a while. So, yeah, you can go ahead with this as well. Whichever you like, whichever you wish that it goes well with the background. You can just select some good color palettes. It actually goes well with the textual content that is written. Because we have not written much textual content, it's not looking that good. Okay. So I just want you all to write a beautiful textual content. That's all. Fine. Now, I think if I if you wish to, for example, yes, for this way, I'll just add some photos of the colors. Okay. Now, if you wish to add the colors of the backgrounds of this photo, okay, then what can you do now? Yes, yes, it's just listen very carefully. Okay. Now for this one. For this one, I want to assign this color, this color, okay, this goldenish color for this one. 
okay how should i do that see what am i going to do just going to select on the background i'll just change the color click on the color okay select the background click the color okay there is something called as hand picking okay how to do that is again there is a setting here okay setting here then there is this this button this is a picker button okay this is picker that something like uh, this range there right come on yes just under this click on that this is a color picker now you can just pick your color this color you want just pick it okay now we are assigning to this one okay pick it and you just have to click on them here just you can pick, pick the colors okay so probably you all liked it Okay, I'm selecting the colors. It's totally whitish. If you want, I can select the whitish color, a bit goldenish color. Then this is how I can pick the color. And if I want to change these colors to white, then you can just change it to your own, in your own ways. Okay. Okay. This is just a uh, way that you can do it. This is just way to change it. Uh, now it's up to you. It's totally uh, your your frame. You just have to change your colors and make sure this design goes very well with the, with the colors right now if, i like it with the white it's the one portion with the white here and also here i want it to be white itself and here also i want it to be white itself if you want i can change the background color to be white but there is like a little bit of color white okay this background if i want i can change if uh, that change it according to the for example for this background we'll make sure this is the color palette this color palette will be brownish if you want this one okay, make sure you're giving it like good thing okay good. if you do not like this colors if you do not like the colors of this image you can change this image to some other and then you can select the colors of your tree that matches with the background so now so we are done with the different design come on new page Another design. Come on, dear sisters and brothers, do not set back. You can just create wonders for this designing. Okay, and just now, I just want to tell you some of the beautiful backgrounds how we can make. Okay, how we can make some beautiful backgrounds. Um, name of the elements. Okay, blobs. B L O B S. I probably created a very beautiful page for an event. Create design for an event. With the blobs, probably I have it or not. I do not know. Just creating it now. Okay. Okay. This one was something with the blobs that I had created. Okay. Something with the blobs. Something like this. Okay. I'll sh I'll make sure we'll do it with the uh, together as well. Same thing together, inshallah. With blobs and something like um, blobs. Geo shape. Please write all of this down. These are very excellent things that you all can infer. Okay. Uh, so, blobs and then this one. Okay. Alhamdulillah. Let's go ahead. There is also an application in which you can create your own blobs. Okay. So, even that is best. So, what I'll do, I'll just add another page now. Okay. The color is already assigned by the canvas. So, don't worry about the color. Now, I'm thinking of just making sure that you all learn how to create your own backgrounds, inshallah. Uh, I mean, some classy backgrounds. If you just have one product in hand, two products in hand. I recently did for a supermarket and I just wanted to show you. April show, not a supermarket. Uh, for another April show, I just uh, did a big a bit of uh, different thing in the background. So I just want to show you how you can use. I use the comic background, right? Comic background. Come on, yes, just try this, try this out. This is very excellent. Comic background. Okay. What I used was second one. I used something like this. Even if you want this also. I use this one okay, because this is an A4 size screen. So you just have to increase it in size. Then you just place it here. Okay, you can't use this itself. So what it, what what I did was I applied two different colors of it. Okay, uh, what a uh, simple background, simple background is. Okay, uh, so you can even go ahead with something that is here. Or also, you may take something like this as well. Two backgrounds you can select. Okay, you can put uh, you can invite one up on another. Okay, you know this is this looks very classy. This actually looked very classy when it was played on their uh, LED frames of uh, April store. Right? So how did I do this? Is I added two backgrounds like this, and I just decrease the transparency like this. Okay, decrease the transparency like this. Okay, something like this. Okay, it actually looked so classy. And if you want, if you don't like like both of it to together like this, you can change the colors of this. Something if it's not like yellow in the background. Can change it to something else. Okay. So 
bluish bluish too. I'll just add bluish behind and yellowish at the at the front frame. Or if you wish to don't if you wish to add a bluish behind and something uh some like if you want to give a bit of lightish look, then you just can select some light uh light weighted uh this one designs where it uh it went. Right? It was just added for uh to give a flash sale thing. Thing. You know, I just saw the same print, something like this, most similar like this, on a ads for the Libas. Okay, they just added something like this, and they wrote flash sale over there. I'll show you how beautifully they. Oh, uh, it it was actually I felt like we I just did the same thing. You just can do the flash sale, and uh, they wrote it something like this. Flash on this one, this one, that similar thing was uh, seen on the recent ad thing it was quite quite pretty uh excellently done flash sale and then there was something like uh there was two to there were two to three verdicts written here and there that uh, up to 50 percent off on products or something like that and then it was done that's all this was the thing this was the content and then just they added some animation flash sale had to appear in very animated format you can make sure this is uh, added and the format is the right no Something like it should be stomp. Okay, stomp is excellent. Stomp thing, tumble thing. Stomp is excellent because it feels like it's stamped up. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Come on, you can just make sure they are designing the things very beautifully, fine. And then uh, once it is, uh, once it has come, then you can just add a text after that. Uh, add a text box. I'll add a text, and that you can just write uh, 50 to 60 percent off on the all the products. 50 percent off on all the products on all of the apparel. Uh, basically over there it was written something like there is a sale and 50 percent off on the all the ethnic cloth something like that was written here 50 percent off on all the products and there was something like even for uh, the end of season sale there was something the same kind of flyer you can just infer these are very easy ones these are very easy choices that you all can make very easy ways that you can Generate your own flyer. So remember, once you start getting the clients, you can get the clients of various origins, various, I mean, the uh, various uh, products, the various businesses. So you all can do it very excellently, ensure that it's not set back. Now, now was the start of your journey. You just have to take some of the many steps towards the excellent or the wide area of the uh, what we say designing, inshallah. But this is just a simple copy. You can add some else, something else. There was something like the, even this one announcement thing. Announcement. What is it called as mics, microphones, announcement icon? Yeah, something like this was added. Yes, it was added like this. Okay, even if this this be for the uh, animation, if you want it animated, you have it all in the Canva fine. So do not worry. You don't have to set back. You just can create your wonderful content and wonderful ways. Inshallah. This is just an idea. Then you can just give the uh, store name here somewhere here below here you can just add www.earlypass.com or whatever uh i had made this uh, for a supermarket so for an apple store or something named uh, i just don't want to mention that but apple store okay then um i just added the uh this symbol somewhere here i added this then somewhere don't miss out, then uh, it was played as an animated video and they actually had put it on the, as the ads on Instagram as well as Facebook. Okay. So now you can just add another page. Hope you understood how you just can create very easily the uh, uh, backgrounds. Now you don't like this colors, you want to color it in different ways, then you can do it in different ways also. Again, now you can just go ahead with the comic backgrounds. They're very excellent comic backgrounds, but just we want the strips in it, that's all. If you want this strip, I actually did it uh, something else with this as well. Okay. One like the strip, and then you can just color it up with whichever color you want. Above it, let me just apply this multiple colors you want. This one I'll just apply above it. Black strip, let it retain behind. For this one, we are just reducing the transparency and giving it a look like it is having the see here, it is having this color. Okay. okay. Or whatever you wish to decide, yes, just do this. You can send this to back and that to friend okay for this background if you wish to add white in the background if you wish to add that black strip then you can bring bring that forward and add the strips okay this is how you can all 
create your even this CS, even this one if you wish to. Okay. Okay. Transfer is reduced. See here, it looks very classy. Now you created something yellowish. This is something bluish. Okay. Now, if you just have to add something in the center and make sure you are doing this, then you can do it in this way. Then another, I created another, for another, another flyer for someone with a big sale and they were, there was something like limited stock available, hurry up for this one. Uh, all of these things, they were actually giving a sale. So we just added to something like this, to the center. And then there was something like, uh, which buttons is probably called as the striking buttons, lightning buttons, yes. Lightning added, okay. Come on, uh, take this down, lightning. Lightning, um, it was icon, lightning icon that I added. Something like this here and there. Okay, the background was not this, so it was not even that class. Make sure you add a beautiful background. Take the fail like this, and then you can just add your own. If you want to flip the door, flip for your own. Okay. Then you can just mention to it whatever you wish to. Uh, well, visit us now, visit our store, and then you just have to mention their address or something. Okay. See how beautifully we designed the three backgrounds, right? So make sure you're designing it very wonderfully. And then uh, I had to create something for the products as well. So how did I create was, it was uh, something like, um, okay, there was, a, there, was a, there was a sale. They had it for the t-shirts and the pants, okay? There were t-shirts and pants. And for that, they had different, what we say, different uh, amount, okay? Uh, different uh, 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 MRPs or uh, they had the special prices for the uh, sale, okay? So what we have to do, we have to add the products for that, right? So for the products, send me what I selected, okay, themes, uh, I just select themes, because I'm just going to head with the hand. So we'll just go with this one, very first one. So take this one. So to, just to make sure that, we are having the products in the frame. Then shirts. For the shirts, I selected something like this. Okay, I'll just put paste it somewhere here. Okay. Now to show that this product costs this much, this product costs this much in our flash sale. So how you do that? You just have to have the labels. And also the background, I already told you you can just select the same background. I just copy this down background i liked it or you can just create your own background with the comic thing so to the uh, to, uh, to produce something like this it's a very excellent the copy comic something in the middle if you want to write and uh, give it a good excellent look this comic backgrounds help you a lot right something in the middle you are going to focus something that is on the center of the screen then this comic backgrounds will go well with the assistant okay because you place the back see here how beautiful it is we are just placing the products in the place where we want to put, where we, where we have the space there. Okay, now I just can add the labels. What label should I add? I want something like pricing there. Label, pricing, where is the tag? If I wish more, even you can write tag over there. Okay, price tag you can write. You have so many beautiful tags, you can just say, grab it up. Okay, this one if you want to. Okay, you can just mention this. For this one, it's this much cost. For this one, it is this much. Okay, uh, in our current sale, we are going to give it to this much to this pricing okay or you can if you have very extra um extra discounted product you can just mention it here and there okay, 100 for this uh, t-shirt and just 200 for the jeans and then you can just mention everything oh the, it is totally up to you now the text writing the stylizing typography which 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 store is uh, offering the services and what is it doing so you just have to write it all by your Mark, we have to create so many things. Inshallah, just give me five more minutes. What I'm thinking of doing is, uh, we'll just uh, okay, we'll just create one or two steps and then we'll end this session. Okay? Hope you all are doing it all together with me. Inshallah, Tala. Okay. Okay. Even your sisters and brothers, for this one, if you want to make a banner of this thing, then you can just change the ratios of this aspect ratio of this. Okay. Now we'll address that topic and then we'll go ahead with some other things because. Uh, that topic uh, of resizing this design is very important. Right? For example, now you have created this design, yes, sisters and brothers, and you have to send it to your client. Okay. Now your client wants this to be posted on the Instagram ads 
facebook ads whatsapp ads and they want it or they also want the same design as well as a flyer or posters or the poster posters what they make pamphlets for the pamphlets and everything there is some others this is the frame that they go ahead with it so the same aspect ratio aspect ratio someone is asking the question what is aspect ratio it's dimension already mentioned it's dimension yes it is correct i use the word aspect ratio because we had this with the video editing software we had a video editing software in the previous course with the video editing software where we had to mention about the aspect ratios of the videos okay the aspect ratio is nothing but the dimensions of the photos or the flyers so this is the flyers that we have okay now the client has asked you that i do not want my uh, this one design the flyer format now i want it to be done in the format of the uh, ads okay you know ads are a bit shorter than this okay a bit shorter it, it is something like this facebook ads instagram ads so how to do that dear sisters and brothers how to change the aspect ratio of this designs okay come on you have a very good tool can you all mention to me i mentioned it in this very second class of ours can you all mention to me what is the tool in which you can just change the size of this okay this is called as resize and magic switch it will magically do it. yes excellent dear sister uh it's resize and magic switch you just have to click on the resize and magic switch now your client you have created this in the flyer format and you don't have to sit back and do it once again this tool is very 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 excellent it works magic now you just can go with a what do you want it for to be done for ads right you'll just write ads here okay which ad do you want to make it for so if you're going to make it for the facebook ad because facebook instagram whatsapp all three have the same aspect ratio so we'll just add facebook ad or instagram ad or whichever ad you want facebook ad facebook ad and continue okay continue all the designs all the eight designs will be will be easily resized and switched on to the new design what do, what do you like to do this with would you like to resize to, would you like to resize this design itself no you just have to click on copy and resize and you will be able to resize it within the moment fine so it, one more thing make sure that whatever the ads you are creating over there just have to you just have to manipulate some of the things and then you have to post it as a ad okay so that's all and also there is there are the ads in the stories remember that yes this brothers facebook and uh, on the story that goes well with the flyers okay the aspect ratio of the flyers is enough for the facebook story ads or the instagram ads on the stories and whatsapp story ads okay remember that only for the uh, thing for the post ads then you just have to go ahead with the uh, this one okay so alhamdulillah we designed so many beautiful designs right at least the seven designs we have done it together one more one last design we'll do it and we'll just end the session inshallah taala okay okay uh, i'm just thinking of making a henna design okay henna design appointments or beauty parlor appointments or uh there is something like the various uh, things they have mentioned on the uh this one uh what i'm thinking i'll just take one appointment kind of for ad and then tomorrow inshallah we'll see some more of the aspects inshallah okay so come on yes sisters and brothers let's do this together it's totally uh, uh excellently it, it can be excellently done you just have to have beautiful backgrounds that's all so i'll just write henna here henna okay, this is a service as a service design so what i'll just do is i'll see if we have some good graphics or if we have some photos we'll just grab some beautiful photos this is photos goes well so i'll just add this as a background replace the background we are done we just uh, we just want it to be reduced okay what i'll do i'll just crop this up like this okay now i just want i'm done now i just want to make sure i want to add the content on it right so to add the content i'm thinking of doing something like i'll go to the elements go to the shapes okay go ahead with the shape and i'm taking the shape like this itself uh, what i'm thinking of doing is reducing the transparency of this uh, background so to reduce the transparency of this background i'll apply something on the about about this and i'll just reduce its transparency reduce its transparency something like this see yeah, now the transparency of the background has reduced now you want you can apply whichever color you want blue color red color green color something like that see here yeah, you just convert the designs into which color you whichever color you like isn't it going excellently uh, isn't it excellently done yes right alhamdulillah the next thing that you all have to do is the textual content textual content is very excellent you can type it very very excellently or if you want to show your designs in different formats you can show your designs in the frames okay go to the frames see if you have some beautiful frames 
to have some excellent innovative frame select those the end of frames what i'm thinking of selecting okay in which you just have to exhibit your talents like you just have to put your skills whatever you have uh, or designs you have created you just have to put it there right so i want to select two of the designs even you can if you want you can select something like this make sure you are selecting two creative looks in which you're giving multiple what you say multiple copies of the designs and which you have designed different uh this one. okay i think i think that i can put this here and another something like that was here right so i'll put it at the down frame something like that it's totally up to you yes it is brother i have just put it here i'll just put it here now i just want to put the uh, design again i'll go to the elements or i'll ask my uh, ask my client to offer me that i'll just click on element oh, sorry i just want to have henna design right henna design so if they are the design for the clients take the client's design and put it in the frame type of one if, it, if you do not like that you just want to put, uh, make sure or if they are offering even a uh, service of uh, this one even handy cones henna cones then you can even go ahead with that as well or you can select very beautiful here if you just want to change the design itself you can change it okay it's totally up to you dear sisters brothers how you want to manage things in your design it's totally your creativity that just put inside your design okay if you want to put this you can just go ahead with this or whatever okay now tip a uh, typography very important thing typography you have to type it very perfectly with the uh, with the backgrounds what is the ma major thing that you have to address here dear sisters brothers is the typography in which you will just say some of the textual content uh, we'll just write a text box henna design henna design by you can just mention by artist so and so duplicate it by artist a b c d okay remember whenever you're going going ahead with the text remember you have to choose a beautiful font remember that this one i'll take this one and not designs or if i wish to write it more bolder write it here by artist a b c d this one i can write it in the format of the uh this one as well right and writing so i'll just select this one uh i can change this coloring as well or i'll just write it here now yes just brothers appointments are available you can write appointments for the appointments you can just write it in your own ways okay appointments available this is usually written in the format of the narrow text appointment appointments okay it should be very narrow text because uh, for the appointments usually they actually write it in the format narrow you just write narrow in the text format you will have actually the beautiful narrow text let's so see here if it goes well see yeah, if this goes well so i'll just add this one appointment and uh, or i think you can even have some what more better than that okay this is better appointments available for availability we will just make sure we are adding it here again typography is the main thing that you all have to learn here okay available because textual content should be very well written available so i'll just write available in the handwriting format just close this handwriting go to the handwriting select some beautiful fonts available this is also looking good i'll just keep it as such Colors of the fonts is very important. Then the henna designing just doesn't look that classy. Even this doesn't look that classy. If you want to delete it, delete it. Okay, delete the frame itself. Henna design by artist. This one. Okay, you can even put it like uh, something like round in the round format or on the above itself. You can put it. It's totally up to you. Okay, henna design by artist appointments available. Then we will just add some shapes. some shapes like this rectangular shapes okay we'll just put it here we'll just put these shapes here somewhere here okay, in this frame one shape and here you should write the appointments uh, appointment informations like phone number where you have to call what is this one and uh, if you want to add another thing at this at the bottom like uh, 
uh, home service available or you have to get to the certain destination to get the design done or something like that, you can add it. So Alhamdulillah, we're done. This is what we have created. You can just add uh, the wedding season sale, 50% uh, off on all the designs with the with the uh, with the bride. We just we can also offer it for the <coughs> bridesmaids or something like that as well. And if you just can mention the phone, phone number, you should write it in the with the phone logo. Phone logo. And see yeah, how we can place it here see, in this way. I just have to place it. It looks very classy here. Yes. The colors we did not choose. We just have to choose it very wisely. Again, I'm telling you. Colors choose very wisely. It's again the color palette that saves your day. We are within one hard year, sisters and brothers. We created eight designs. Now think if you get a client, how well you can do that. Just give your 15 to 20 minutes and you can create your uh, designs and just give it to them. Remember the clients that you get, they do not know even A or even B of the design. Okay? They do not know anything of the design. Even, uh, even if you get the clients, know everything. You don't have to worry because you have an excellent tool in hand. You can just go ahead with the templates as well. Okay, do not do not worry even for a second about these things, right? So now you just have to create it very beautifully. Now you just can go to the styles and change the colors. Sorry, I just changed the font combinations also. Remember, colors uh, is different, font combination is different. So yeah, did you all like it? This thing is very perfectly done. Color palettes, okay? Because once your colors doesn't match us with the background, it doesn't go so well, right? So make sure you are doing it so well, aligning it so well, the backgrounds. Right? Yeah, this looks very classy. This is done. So beautiful. So alhamdulillah, dear sisters and brothers, we are done with the session. At least eight designs we have created. I want you all to create it all along, inshallah. Uh, if you all have done this together, barakallahu fiki. If you have not done it, you can do it after the class or inshallah. On Wednesday, we are going to take a leave and you can just sit back and complete your homeworks all together, inshallah. So, alhamdulillah, dear sisters and brothers, this was, this was the session for today and we all have designed so many beautiful flyers together. So, jazakumullah khayyan kaseera. Hopefully, you all found this very interesting, very excellently done. So, barakallahu fiki, dear sisters and brothers, take care of yourselves, inshallah. See you all in tomorrow's class. Tomorrow, we have a class. Tomorrow, we have a class, inshallah. On Wednesday, we are going to take a leave, inshallah. So, if you're not going to come uh, get get uh, get back tomorrow, for example, if you're staying in some other places where there is a uh, your mulashura fasting, so remember uh, you can just uh, uh, take it uh, take the class using the recordings, inshallah. Okay. So alhamdulillah, dear sisters, brothers, let's all let's all gather together tomorrow as well, inshallah, with the spirit to learn more, with the spirit to design something. Uh, something uh, very interesting, very innovative, very creative, inshallah. And we all designed very perfectly. See, uh, look at the designs. You feel like this were designed uh, by you or something? No, no, right? These are very classy, right? Yes, sisters and brothers. You just can design it very perfectly, inshallah. So, alhamdulillah, these are the designs that we have uh, done today. So, just have a look on this. Then, inshallah, we'll get back soon. Jazakumullah khairan kaseera, dear sisters and brothers here. Take care of your sisters. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Subhanakallahumma wa bihamdika. Nashadu Allah ilaha illa anta astaghfirullah wa barakatuh.